Good morning. Oh, Lord Jesus, I come to you as humble as I know how, asking you for forgiveness. Lord, forgive me for being selfish. Forgive me for seeking the things that I desire and not seeking the things that you desire. Forgive me, Lord, for thinking of myself highly than you think that I ought to be. Forgive me, Lord, for not staying into your word and spewing your word out of my mouth and out of my heart and my soul. Forgive me, Lord. Forgive me for all that I should be doing and I have not done. Amen. Oh, Lord, there's so much violence going on in Louisville, Kentucky, and uh, yes, it's happening around the world. But, Lord, right here, what I see and what I hear, and I see the effects of the people that is, is in, uh, that is harming. I pray, Lord Jesus, that the families that lost a little boy, I don't know the circumstances, but I know that he's dead. I pray, Lord Jesus, for that family. I pray that in that situation, anything that needs to be revealed, it is revealed. I pray for the stabbings and the killings that's occurring every day in, the, in Louisville, Kentucky. I pray, Lord, that you stop the gun. Stop the gun. Don't let the bullet come out of the gun, Lord. I don't want anyone to become dead or injured, but let that bullet stop. Let your word come out of people's mouths. Let some word come into that person's heart before they think about pulling a gun or pulling a knife, pulling any type of weapon that could kill another person, Lord Jesus. Also, Lord, as I'm praying for others, I need prayer for myself, Lord. I pray that I stop. Ooh, Lord Jesus, tell on myself. Lord, let me stop cussing people out because I, I know anger, how anger can overflow and, and, and just come out in all sorts of ways that can cause harm uh, mentally, physically. And um, Lord, uh, cease my mouth from saying anything but the words that you would have come out of my mouth, Lord. Ooh, Lord, clean my mind and my heart because I know you're a healer, Lord. I hear a lot of uh, preachers preaching the word, Lord, and the churches, I feel, Lord, forgive me for enviness. Forgive me. Forgive me of that, Lord. Forgive me of wanting what someone else has, Lord. That's not what you uh, call me to do, Lord. Forgive me for that. Forgive me for wanting uh, the clothes and the cars and the houses and the things that others have, the money, the jobs that other people have, Lord. Forgive me. Forgive me, Lord. Clean my spirit of that, Lord. That's envious and self-pride, Lord, and ego. Lord, remove my ego. Remove my pride, Lord. Forgive me for wanting things that other people have when you have blessed me so highly and so favorably, Lord. Let me be pleased with what you have done for me, and let me move in the direction and the pace that you would have me to move, Lord. Don't let me want what somebody else has, Lord, because I don't know what it had taken for them to get that, and what you give to another, Lord, you surely would not give to me. Thank you, Lord, not in that situation, Lord. Forgive me for having eyes that looks at what others have, Lord, and not looking at what I have. Lord, you blessed me to wake up just like you woke them up, Lord. You woke me up with breath in my body and eyes to see and hear. Thank you, Lord, for that. Forgive me for being so disrespectful to you, for being ignorant. Lord, forgive me, forgive me. Lord Jesus, let me be your servant. I kneel down before you. I will worship you. Forgive me for wasting so much of your time and my time of being disobedient. <sighs> Forgive me. But I pray, Lord Jesus, for the violence to stop and for those guns to be plugged up. Don't let the pen or whatever's in that gun, don't let it come out. Don't let it come out. Only your words come out and penetrate the hearts of those people that want to per perpetrate that violence. I pray this in all the goodness and the gracious that be bestowed on people. I pray for the children, Lord. I want them to know you. I want them to know all about you, how you are healed because you healed me. Lord, I was a mental defect, Lord. My mind and thoughts were racing continuously, Lord, but you saw fit. You saw fit. You saw your grace. You gave me grace and you gave me mercy. You didn't have to do it because I'm nothing but a filthy rag, but you healed me. You heal my mind, and I will serve you all the days of my life, and I will always do what I can to bring others to you. Forgive me 
for having my foot stand still. In the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen.